You know, at first glance, when I seen them uncover a tunnel with petroglyphs at the 16 foot level, I, uh, I was impressed, you know, it really definitely stuck with me and caused me to shift my, my focus and my understanding to some extent. And, uh, you know, some people question that, oh, they, they carved that ahead of time and buried it, you know, and I, uh, I, I couldn't help but, but ponder the idea that it's possible, you know, although how long it took and, and, and watching everything that they went through to get to the point that they're at, um, you know, just the first cave, I, I mean, it, it was extensive and months of, of effort and, and exploration and, and understanding. So to, to see this now, you know, have gone to this extent where they're continuing to still dig, you know, two years later on the same property, um, and, and the amount of effort and documentation that, that is being provided here over this process, um, it, it would be extremely hard to believe that, that they were sitting there burying entire tunnels as we were sitting here unburying tunnels, and, you know, because that's exactly what they would have to do to continue this if, if they were, or they would have had to have, have buried all of this ahead of time, which is insane to think about the hundreds of pieces and the multiple tunnels at this depth with all of this uh, artwork and, and pieces and you know to, to conceive that and to continue it still you know it's not like they're done now it's not uh, all wrapped up this is something that continues today continues tomorrow and may continue well into the future and and I think that there's very little effort being put in to these grounds compared to what they have to offer and I think in the future we'll likely start to see that as technology grows with GPR things like that we're starting to map the rainforests and places that we couldn't even understand or get to before because it was so remote and we're starting to find that there's there's structures there and uh, that's a pretty good hint that they've been there for a while and I think we'll start to see that a lot of this stuff has been there for a lot longer than what we initially conceived the more I continue to research ancient history, languages, it, it becomes very evident that there is commonality between cultures and people on this planet. And that commonality is, is very dominant, that there was something before us that went on here or before our current way of civilization there was a, there was something else and we have obvious proof in the stone age monuments and megaliths that are all over this world many that we still couldn't even fathom how they could be constructed today and i, I believe to say that uh, some of the the recent findings are showing structures that look like the three pyramids and, and items that could rewrite history and there's places like Gobekli Tepe that is rewriting history. However, the people currently in charge of that site are now saying that it's 100 to 150 years before we'll be able to fully excavate the land and that it's very, very much being focused as a tourist place now so people can see it. What's interesting there is that we've basically tapped grounds that show that there was a civilization 13,000 years ago and now it's being uh, suppressed in ways that is, is limiting the research that can be done there. And uh, I, I find this all too common with too many places around the world. And that, that's something that I, I fully don't understand because this topic and this understanding, you know, it, unless there's a higher purpose of us being in the dark, I, I just don't fathom what the point of limiting research and, and knowledge is in, in, unless it's purely just the fact of, of processing it in a, in a way that we can accept it. And I, I think that might be, of all the things, really what we're seeing is the hardest part about learning this truth is the people accepting it. And I'm one of them. It's really hard to accept. But I continue to learn and I keep an open mind. And I hope you do too.